Back in 2004, the discovery of Apophis was a wake-up call for scientists, as our grasp of near-Earth objects was still in its early stages. Using the Kitt Peak National Observatory in Arizona, astronomers first detected this asteroid, initially called 2004 MN4. It was later renamed Apophis after the ancient Egyptian god of chaos and destruction, an apt choice given the potential danger it posed to our planet. This finding sparked a sense of urgency and curiosity within the scientific community. In the vast expanse of our solar system, a large asteroid named Apophis is causing a stir due to its potential threat to Earth. On April 13th, 2029, Apophis will zip past our planet at an incredibly close distance, only 19,000 miles from our surface, closer than some satellites. The uncertainty about whether Apophis will impact Earth in 2068 raises fears of unimaginable devastation, and we must question whether we're prepared for this possible encounter. Let's dive deeper into this intriguing situation. Apophis captured the attention of astronomers due to its sheer size, approximately 1,220 feet in diameter, making it one of the largest near-Earth asteroids. But it wasn't just its size that made Apophis stand out. Its unique orbit and characteristics stirred intrigue and debate among scientists. Equipped with cutting-edge telescopes and sensors, astronomers have been able to track Apophis' movement in relation to distant stars and calculate its orbital path to anticipate its future trajectory. Notable experts in astronomy like Neil deGrasse Tyson quickly acknowledged the serious threat that an asteroid like Apophis poses. While many scientists focused on the technical aspects of the asteroid, Tyson emphasized the broader risks that these celestial bodies present. He famously stated, The universe is a deadly place. It constantly tries to kill us. So does Earth, but we humans excel at avoiding death. His statement serves as a reminder of the gravity of the situation and our resilience in the face of cosmic challenges. Join us as we explore the mysteries of Apophis. We will discover that the universe has its own surprises. Stay tuned. What is the most unique about Apophis? Engage with us. Drop your theories and questions in the comments below. Like and subscribe to the Astronomer channel and turn on notifications to stay updated on future space explorations. Our solar system has a curious way of keeping time. And on Friday, April 13th, 2029, a monumental event will take place. Apophis, a massive asteroid about 300 meters wide, will come dangerously close to Earth. It will pass just 19,000 miles above our planet, closer than some of our satellites orbiting in space. Although the thought of such a close encounter might seem alarming, there's no need to worry. Scientists are confident that Apophis will safely fly by Earth without colliding. This near-miss offers a golden opportunity for scientists to learn more about asteroids that come close to Earth. But there's a twist. Apophis could return in 2068, possibly with more dangerous intentions. Let's dive deeper into this intriguing cosmic narrative. You might be surprised to learn that an object the size of Apophis only approaches Earth once every thousand years, making the 2029 event truly extraordinary. Richard Binzel, a planetary scientist at MIT, emphasized the importance of this event during the International Planetary Defense Academy. He pointed out that the asteroid's size and how close it comes to Earth will make it bright enough for around two billion people to see it with their own eyes. Picture an ancient relic from the early solar system flying past us so closely. One fascinating topic scientists explore is the Yarkovsky effect. This is the difference in temperature between the daytime and nighttime sides of the asteroid, which can cause a gentle force that nudges the asteroid in a certain direction. 
Even though this effect is subtle, it can shift the asteroid's orbit significantly over time. In Apophis's case, understanding this effect is crucial. While its 2029 path is clear, the unpredictability of this effect makes it hard to forecast Apophis's future course with certainty. Scientists have 10 years to prepare for Apophis's approach, and they are getting ready to gather as much information as possible. Not only will this help us understand Apophis better, but it will also shed light on other dangerous asteroids. Apophis is believed to be similar to about 80% of the known hazardous asteroids out there. Imagine the possibilities of studying Apophis up close. Scientists are exploring the idea of sending spacecraft to watch the asteroid before, during, and after its close pass in 2029. What if the 2029 flyby isn't Apophis's only close encounter with Earth? Astronomers and space fans are keeping their eyes on the year 2068 because that's when Apophis could collide with our planet. This thought-provoking possibility leaves us wondering about the asteroid's future impact. Let's talk about the keyhole concept. Imagine throwing a stone into a pond at a particular angle and speed. It might bounce a few times before sinking. Similarly, a gravitational keyhole is an area in space that can change the path of an asteroid, like a shortcut around a planet. If Apophis passes through a certain keyhole during its approach in 2029, it could be set on a direct path to hit Earth in 2068. So, what would happen if Apophis hit our planet? The immediate area of impact would face massive destruction. Moving at several kilometers per second, the asteroid would release energy equivalent to billions of atomic bombs. This would create a massive crater possibly several kilometers wide. The heat from the impact would be incredibly intense, instantly vaporizing the asteroid and a large section of the Earth's crust at the crash site. This would lead to a blast of molten rock and debris shooting into the atmosphere, creating a massive fireball that would destroy everything it touches. If Apophis were to hit an ocean or sea, the destruction would be even worse. The impact would unleash enormous tsunamis with waves towering hundreds of meters high. These waves would sweep across ocean basins, destroying coastal cities and towns. The impact would also cause seismic shocks, triggering earthquakes thousands of kilometers from the crash site and affecting areas unprepared for such events. The long-term consequences of an Apophis impact would be severe. Large amounts of debris would be thrown into the atmosphere, blocking sunlight and creating a phenomenon known as an impact winter. This could last months or even years, drastically lowering temperatures around the world. Could humans survive the dinosaur-killing asteroid? Has more details to it, which we were not able to cover in this single video, so here is another part which you can dive directly by clicking on the I button. Apart from that, James Webb discovered something so improbable, it shouldn't ever happen. We'll dive into that topic in an upcoming video. Would you be interested in seeing a video about how to deflect asteroids? Share your thoughts in the comments, like and subscribe to check out other videos from the Astronomer channel and make sure you ring the bell for our latest content.